This jump demonstration will show how to compare the performance of predictive models in Jump Pro. We're using the body fat data from the sample data library. We've built multiple models predicting the continuous response body fat and saved their prediction formulas to our data table. For example, here's the formula for our stepwise regression model. The models were built using a validation column with the final form of each model being selected based on performance on a validation set. To compare the model's performance on training and validation sets, we'll go to Analyze, Predictive Modeling, and select Model Comparison. We'll place our model formulas into the Y Predictors role, and our validation column into the Buy role. If we wanted, we could leave the Y Predictors role empty, in which case Jump Pro will include all prediction formulas currently in the data table. When we click OK, we are presented with several model performance statistics for the training and validation sets. Because our response variable body fat is continuous, we're presented with statistics appropriate for continuous response types, including R square, root average squared error, and average absolute error. If our response variable were categorical, we'd be presented with statistics appropriate for that response type. Additional options are available under the red triangle. And, as with the FIT statistics, some of the options available will depend on whether the models are predicting a continuous or categorical response. For either response type, we can invoke the Prediction Profiler to explore the model predictions interactively. Note that Jump Pro's model comparison platform is available through its own menu item, which is how we accessed it here, as well as through a red triangle option inside the Formula Depot platform.